Alright, so the other day I made a video on that Air King by Lasco fan. And I said I'd never seen one of these Galaxy box fans. Um, I don't know why I said that because I have two of them. But anyway, um, this is a 93 to 94 Galaxy by Lasco. This is a 3723. Now, apparently they made a version in the smaller cabinet that was a 3733 or whatever. But I digress. I've never seen one of those. I've only seen these. Um, yeah. These are actually kind of childhood fans because when I was growing up, my aunt had one in her garage. And in that garage was a window that looked out into the backyard. And when I was a kid, I would always look in that window and see the fan sitting on the workbench. Um, I asked her for years and years and years for it, and I never received it until a couple years ago. This is not that fan, though. This one came from my school in trade a long time ago. Back when I used to do fan trades with my school um i'd trade i'd go out and buy them new fans and they'd give me the old ones and this is one of them that came from there um this one's in really good shape though like it did not have a handle when i got it i think i put that on there but other than that it's in pretty good shape it's a three speed has that strap handle that we know and love do not use the handles. Do not use these handles. Because they will snap. And they will break. And you will be sad. It's a galaxy. As we already mentioned. It's got the butter knife D style blades. With the little hole in the hub. Which I always kind of like for some reason. I don't know why. I mean, this one's in pretty nice shape. It's got some scratches and scuffs on it, but I mean, overall, it's in really nice shape. This is the only remnant of it ever being at my school. Not sure what chapter one meant, but something to do with the school. Usually, I grab these fans from the back grill. This thing, it's weird. The back grill's like halfway yellowed like from this screw down it's yellowed but from this screw up it's still white i don't know what happened there but yeah i've had this fan since i want to say i was in middle school or like ninth grade shut up train but anyway I've had this fan for a very long time, and I don't plan to get rid of it, because I do like it. Back of the blades are kind of yellowed, too. I'm not sure why it got yellowed, but it did. It's got the typical Marco motor. Would have had feet, but I never got them. This fan is rust-free, which is nice. Mine is little tiny bit there I guess but really not that bad here's your stamp on the bottom 2.2 amps 93 to 94 and like I said this fan's in overall really really good shape considering it came from my school I don't know if this was something they found and like started using before I got it but yeah it's an oddity that's for sure now let's play the game of turning the fan around there. so yeah there's the whole thing so here's hi Good. 
focus. There we go. I don't exactly use this one a lot because it has a big, pretty bad shape. But it runs really good. Medium. It does have a nice sound to it though. a nice sound to it. quite like it. This was actually Lasco's, I would, this is pretty much their first rounded corner box fan. They made one in the 70s, but it didn't really catch on back then or something because they're very rare. And... So 93, 94 is when they were phasing out the old square corner ones in favor of these. Granted, they sold both around the same time, which is weird, but there's a bit of overlap, if you will. Back to high. But yeah, during 93 to 94, the 3723 was phasing out the square corners in favor of these rounded corner ones. And the next year after this, they had the newer handles. And then there's the older one. But yeah, there's kind of a look at this one. I don't know why I said I'd never seen one, but I have two of them. But yeah, hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching.